It's going. It's going. Yeah. That's good. I'm also at home with New Mexico State Police. Understand the reason why I'm stopping you? Okay, the speed. How fast do you think you're going on I-40 before you took the fly over to head north? What's that? 65. 65? That's the speed limit. I wouldn't be pulling you over for doing the speed limit. Okay. 85. Yeah, you're moving. You actually passed me and then just kept on going. You have a driver's license? Yes. Did you see that little silver car? It was like flashing you actually trying to tell you there's a cop. No. Yeah. Thank you, ma'am. Do you have insurance for the yes. vehicle, miss? Mm -hmm. How y'all doing tonight? Doing good. Good, good to hear. Good, good. Thank you for asking. Are you the owner of the vehicle, miss? Perfect. Thank you. You can hold on to that. Do you have insurance? Yes. Can you pull that out? Uh, it's not on there, but it's on my phone. No worries. Mr. Plus, I'm going to have you step on out, okay? Just have to ask for more questions. Any weapons, knives, guns, anything I need to know about? No. Cool. Go and step on out of the vehicle, please. Sure. Meet me at the road. So I'm going to turn off the signal and leave it on. You can leave it on. It's fine. Yes. Go and walk over your phone, please. Uh -huh. All right, walk to the front of my unit. Straight to the front bumper. Hi. Miss Kelsey, like I said, 85 miles an hour. Okay. Okay. Speed limit is 65. That's 20 miles over the speed limit. It's a little crazy, right? Yeah. Okay. Miss Kelsey, what was the last time you were pulled over? Uh, it's been a while. It's been a while. Well, that's yeah. a good thing. Yeah. That is. So I'm gonna ask a question. Hopefully you're honest with me. Okay. How much have you had to drink tonight? Uh, like a can. Just one can? Yeah. What kind of can did you have? Uh, one light. One light? Mm -hmm. What size? Uh, 16 ounce. 16 ounce? Okay, and how long ago was that last can? Uh, two hours. About two hours ago? How do you feel right now? I feel good. You feel good? Yeah. Okay, you headed all the way back to Santa Domingo? Yes, sir. Gotcha, it's a long drive. Yeah. Listen, have you had any recent head injuries? No. You wear eye contact? No. Can you do me a favor? Can you stand here on my leg? Uh huh. And then face me. Feet together just like mine, hands direct that's time. I need your man in that position there. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have you start the tip of my right index finger with your eyes sure. and you do not move your head. Do you understand? Sure. Do you have any questions? Yeah. No. See my finger, ma'am? Follow mm -hmm. my finger with your eyes and do not move your head. Do you understand? Yeah. Don't move your head. I'll start that one over, okay? Do not move your head. Okay. Go up the middle, okay, man? Okay. Pull my finger over. Okay, Miss Calabasa, do you have any injuries to your legs or feet? They're going to be walking, bouncing, returning? Yeah. Pretty healthy? Yeah. Gotcha. Are those shoes comfortable to walk in? Somewhat, yeah. Would you like to remove them? 
No. Okay. Come on, have you seen right here? They're just a, like a regular typical cowboy boot type. Okay. No crazy heel, heel or anything like that, right? It's just a, like a one-inch heel. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sit tight. I'll be right back. Okay. Okay. Come on, have you stand right here? On my light, facing the rear of your vehicle. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Right. So there's nothing that's gonna twist your ankle, harm you in any way. It's pretty flat. Yeah. Correct? Yeah. We got you. So listen, I'm gonna have you put your feet together just like mine. So I'm gonna have you keep your hands out of your pocket for me, please. I'm sorry. Right. I know no it's a little chilly, but I'm gonna just have you do that, okay? So All listen, right. I'm gonna have you put your imaginary line on the ground from where your left foot is. Straight out in front of you to my right foot. Can you put your straight line on the ground? Yes right. or no? Right. So yeah, your left foot, straight left out in front of you to my right foot. Can you put your imaginary line on the ground? You're not gonna move. So you're able to pitch that line? Yeah. So the line's gonna be approximately the width of your shoe. Do you understand that? So this goes straight? Not yet. Okay. So are you able to pitch the imaginary line though? Yeah. Okay, so listen, Miss Calabasa, I need you to put your left foot on that line. Take your right foot, place it directly in front of your left foot, touching heel to toe. Okay. Stop right there. Hands direct left side. I'm gonna need you to remain in that position there until I'm done giving you all the instructions. Sure. You will not start to test how tight you do so. Do you understand? Yes or no? Oh, yes. Okay, so listen, not to tell you do so, you're gonna take nine steps forward on this imaginary line. Okay. You're gonna look downward at your feet, count each step out loud, touch hill to toe on each step, and keep your hands directly to side at all times. Uh, no. So look, I'm gonna demonstrate this test to you. It's gonna look like this, man. One, two, three. See how I did one. that? What's that? All at once? Yes, yeah, so you're okay. gonna take nine steps forward. I'm only gonna take three steps, you're gonna take nine steps. You okay. understand? Ready? On your ninth step, your front foot's gonna stay flat on the ground with your back foot, which is your opposite. You're gonna take a series of small steps just like this, turn yourself in the opposite direction. You see how I turn around? You see so how you're I gonna turn take around? nine and then turn. Yes, ma'am. Just okay. turn around just the way I showed. Do you have any questions on the turning process? No. Now you're gonna proceed back nine steps on the same imaginary line, like so. One, two, three. Once again, I took three steps. How many steps are you gonna take? Nine. Once you start this test, you cannot stop until it's completed fully. Do you have any questions? You can just keep your hands out of your pocket. No questions at all? No. Go and begin, ma'am. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then turn, all right? Go and continue with the test. Remember what you. Little, Remember you had to take nine steps back? Okay, stay right there, put your feet together just like mine, hands right that side. You're gonna need your remain in that position there, do you understand? You will not start the test till I tell you to do so. Okay. But when I do tell you to do so, you can pick the foot of your choice. Give you your right foot or your left foot. You're gonna lift that foot approximately six inches from the ground. You can keep your foot parallel to the ground. Hands right to the side, both legs straight. You're going to look down at your raised foot. And you're going to count in an upper manner by 1,000. So this 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004. Continue counting upward by 1,000. So nine? What's that? How many steps? How many seconds? You're going to count in an upper manner by 1,000 until I tell you to stop. So it's a time test of 30 seconds, but you're going to count. Really? Yes. You're going to count and hope to by 1,000 until I tell you to stop. Okay? So look, I'm going to demonstrate this test. Okay. I'm going to pick my right foot for my demonstration, but you can pick your right or your left. You're going to lift that foot approximately six inches from the ground. You see how I'm doing so? You can keep your foot parallel to the ground. Do not point up. This is parallel. Do you understand? Hands right to the side, both legs straight. Look down at your raised foot and go ahead and count. And up the matter by 1,000. So this 1,001, 2003, 2004, and continue counting upward by 1,000 until I tell you to stop. Do you have any questions? <laughs> yeah. What's your question? That's impossible. <laughs> it's not impossible. I mean, I can't. I mean, even if, like, even at home, I can't. I tried it. Okay. I can't do that. You can't do that? No. You can't do that. I don't know. I just, I just can't. Seriously, I can't. I tried it on my exercise because I can work out, and I can't. You can't balance on one foot? No. Okay, do you want to give it a try or you... you can, we can try, but okay. like, I, to be honest, I don't because I tried it at my exercise and it, it doesn't Okay, work. at any time you want to stop, just let me know, okay? Is that fair enough? Mm, yeah, but to be honest, I can't, I can't balance that one. Okay. Balance? I, I don't know, I tried it at home, like I said, like, like I tried to balance, but... Okay. I, don't know. I so, can try, okay. but... Okay, sounds good.
So, no questions at all? You can please understand my instructions? Yeah, okay. yeah, I understand. Go ahead and begin, ma'am. Ready? Yes, ma'am. Oh, man, just like... <laughs> okay, ready? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> I don't know, I just find that hard. So pick your foot up, T can where I left off. This one? Go ahead, continue. Right yes, ma'am. Go and stop. Okay. Just coming to I'm going to have you walk to the front of my uniform, please. Okay. Straight to the front bumper. Just walk normal. Once again, can you get your hands out of your pocket for me, please? And then put your hands down your back. Put your hands down your back and do not move. at this time, which is 1.33 a.m., you are being arrested for DWI. Do you have anything you see stabbing, poking, or harming in any way? No. Nothing in your pockets? No. Do you have anything in your front pockets, your rear pockets? Just, um, I don't even have my phone. Okay. In the car. Do you have a brawl on? Yes. Do you have anything in your brawl? Keys, money? No. Anything in that nature? Okay, so listen, I have to conduct a pad search on you. I'm going to talk you through it. I'm going to utilize the back of my hand and go down the side of your breast. Sure. Also, I'm going to go underneath your breast, by pressure upward towards the direction I'm standing. Do you understand? Nothing is going to hurt me. Nothing no, in charge. No, 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 cool. I'm going to do that now, ma'am. Sorry if I pinch you. Underneath. In between. Nothing in front pockets. No. Uh, just a compact on this side, on the right side. You have a what? Compact? Uh, compact. Makeup? Yes. Okay. Same concept. Sorry if I pinch you. You need the front pocket, you say? Okay. Okay. I'll put that back in the car, okay? And listen, Miss Kielasa, listen. Hmm. I'm going to tell you something important. You're under yeah. arrest for driving under the influence and talk to you and make your drugs. The New Mexico Plex Act requires you to submit to a breath test to determine the alcohol content of your blood. After you take our test, you have the right to choose an additional independent test. If you choose to take this additional independent test, you have the right to reach block pain and answer a physician, a licensed nurse, a laboratory technician, or technologist who is employed by a hospital or a physician of your own choice to perform additional chemical tests. The cost of this additional test is paid by the law enforcement agency, which is the Mexico State Police. Okay. Do you agree to take our test? Yes no. or no? No. So I'm going to continue reading. I cannot force you to take our test, but if you refuse, you will lose your New Mexico driver's license or non res operating privilege for one year. If you are convicted in court of driving while under the influence, you may also receive a greater sentence because you refuse to be tested. Do you understand? Yes. Do you now agree to be tested? No. So I'm going to consider your actions to refuse to be tested at this time as well as you're going to be charged with aggravated DWI. Do you understand? Do you have any questions? No. Can you do me a favor? Can you open your mouth for me, please? Do you have anything in your mouth that you're huh. eating, drinking, or smoking right now? Anything between your teeth and your tongue? No. Okay, time is 1.35. Go and walk to the room of my vehicle, please. Can I, can I let my friend know? I'll let her know. Well, because I live in South Dominica, she lives in San Luis. Okay, I'll let her know. We'll get her away. Go and walk to the room of my vehicle, please. So you're going to repo my car? It's going to get towed. Really? Yes, ma'am. Go and walk to the room of my vehicle, please. Oh, Have you had a seat? Is your cell phone in the vehicle now? Uh, it's in my car. Would you like to grab it? Or want me to grab it so you can have it with you? Yes. Can you lean back and look to your left, please? I'm going to go over you and buckle you in, okay? Watch your elbow. 